The state government's given the green light to the development of a Lynx golf course on Crown land in southern Tasmania. The Opossum Bay project is expected to dramatically boost tourist numbers by 2016. Five years after it was first mooted, developers of the Arm End project have been granted a lease from the Parks and Wildlife Service. There we can move on to uh, constructing what we believe will be a world-class uh, public golf course. The Lynx course will be spread across the 121 hectare peninsula. The site is spectacular. It, it is public land and it always will be public land. Um, we're looking to improve it on an environmental level. The development includes a golf hut, cafe and car park with long-term plans for accommodation. There'll be walking and cycling tracks. This, I believe, will turn it into a really great recreational spot for a whole heap of people. Before the developers can turn their attention to the golf course, the first job is removing major infestations of weeds and starting to regenerate the land with native plants. We work, walk on the, uh, the arm end every day and we see it firsthand every day and there's so much there that can be done that's going to be fantastic for the environment. Some locals aren't happy. Our major concerns are that the lease grants uh, the whole of the Gillibrand Point Nature Reserve to a private developer. Questions are being asked about where water for the golf course will come from and whether it will lead to less local usage. Would you want to be walking your dog through a golf course? <laughs> Would you want to cycle with balls coming hither and thither? Work is expected to begin in about six months. Lucy Shannon, ABC News, Opossum Bay.